take a look at that slab of meat. Look at that slab of meat. I love meat. The word slab means a flat, a flat piece of something. Like if there's a slab of rock. You know, like let's say um, you want to make your kitchen counter out of, you, you know, like nice homes, luxury homes. They make their kitchen counters out of like granite or quartz or some kind of stone. So then you need a slab of stone. You could call this a slab of meat. I love meat. Now guys, do you prefer meat or chicken? That's a mistake. That question was a mistake. A lot of English learners make that mistake. Okay, they might ask, uh, do you like fish or meat? The question doesn't make sense in English because some loud noises coming from my condo building, guys. So meat, fish is meat, chicken is meat. Right. So it's a kind of a weird question. You know, a lot of languages around the world make a distinction between the word meat and chicken or fish. Okay. Well, yeah, a lot of languages do. Maybe in your language. Let me know. In your language, what does the word meat mean? Because in English, meat means any kind of flesh okay so we're, we could talk about you know the meat of a bird or a fish or a cow or a any, anything humans you know meat you have meat your humans are made up of meat right and fat fat is well is fat meat fat is like a part of sometimes kind of like a part of meat now this meat here isn't very fatty Okay, you can see that's pretty lean. If meat doesn't have a lot of fat, you can say it's lean. Do you prefer lean meat or fatty meat? I prefer fatty meat actually, but this piece of, this slab of beef is, uh, is pretty lean. Okay, so that's a mistake that I've heard quite a few times. It's because in your language, Maybe like languages like German or, uh, you know, uh, I've just a bunch of language, a lot of languages in the world make this distinction between meat and, and chicken or fish. Well, in English, all of them are meat. If you want to describe this kind of meat, then you say red meat. Like if you want to be specific, then you, we, have a, we have a word for that in English. And that word is red meat. Okay, so your question should be, do you prefer red meat or chicken? Okay, or do you prefer, you know, red meat or fish? Because fish is meat. Chicken is meat. Okay, so if you want to say, get specific and compare like beef with chicken, if that's what you're asking, then you should use the actual word for that kind of meat, which is beef. Okay, this is beef. All right, now um, let's look at Google, all right? I just looked up Google before hitting the record button here uh, to see what, what, what is red meat, okay? Because very often you hear this in our culture. People say you should avoid red meat because it's not healthy. Yeah, everybody has their own opinions on what, what is healthy and what's not, right? Some people don't eat red meat. Some people eat chicken and fish. Some people might only eat fish. And some people might only eat chicken. Some people might only eat red meat. I've heard of people who go on, a, on just a red meat diet. That's all they eat. They don't eat chicken. They don't eat fish. So let me know, what, what is your, what's your preferred meat? Do you prefer red meat or um, white, you know, very often chicken, 
or turkey, I think they're referred to as white meat. Now fish is, I don't think fish is referred to as white meat. It's, you know, I don't know. Let, let's just look at what, what Google has to say here, okay? About what, which meats are red meats. So it says red meat refers to beef, veal, lamb, mutton, pork, goat, and venison. Okay, do you know what all those words mean? Okay, sometimes the name of the meat changes depending on whether the animal is a baby or an adult. Okay, cows are one of those and sheep are another. Pigs? No, uh, no, I don't think so. Or goat? I don't think, uh, goat. I think the two that are most important here in this list anyway are cows and sheep. So there's two different names for those meats. So let's talk about it, okay? What is beef? Well, I just showed you beef. My nice steak that I'm going to barbecue after making this video. You want to come over for a slab of beef, <laughs> a steak? I love steak, guys. Um, so the word beef means the meat from an adult cow. Okay, I don't think it matters if the cow is male or female. Um, <clears throat> there might be technical words out there, but, but generally beef means the meat from an adult cow. Now there is a word for the meat from a baby cow. A baby cow is called a calf, okay? And a calf's meat is called veal. Did you know that? Smash that like button if you didn't know what veal was. Okay, so beef, adult cow, veal, calf, baby cow, right? Uh, now, the same for goat, okay? Uh, what's a baby? No, sorry, not goat, uh, sheep, okay? A baby sheep is called a lamb, and its meat is also called lamb. Okay, that's easy to remember. Lamb, lamb. Now, an adult sheep is called a sheep. What's its meat called? It's not called sheep meat. It's called mutton, mutton, mutton. Right? When we say that word, M-U-T-T-O-N, mutton, we, we don't really say the T. Listen to this. Mutton. 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 It's a weird word. Mutton. Can you say that? Mutton. <laughs> it's kind of a funny word to say. Um, <clears throat> okay, the next one on the list is pork. I guess pork is also called red meat. Pork is the meat from a pig, okay? Now, I don't think it matters whether the pig is an adult or a baby. Um, now, and the same with goat. So a baby goat is called a kid, but uh, I don't think we would use any kind of meat. I don't know if, I, I don't know, guys, what the word for a, the meat from a baby goat would be. If you know, I don't think there is a word. I've never heard a word for that. It's just called goat meat, okay? So it doesn't matter what the age of the goat is. It's just goat. So if you say, I, I like goat, we're not talking about the animal. We're talking about the meat. So this sentence, I like goat, it only has one meaning, and that is meat. If you want to say you like animal, the animals, then you have to say, I like goats with an S. I love goats. That means you love the animal. If you say, I love goat, that means you're talking about the meat, right? It's just like if you say, I love beef, or I love veal, or, I love lamb, or mutton, or pork, or goat, or venison. That was the last one on the list. Venison. What is venison? 
That's probably a, a new word for you. Venison means the meat from a deer. Okay, so we're talking about wild game here. Wild game is... That, that word wild game means animals that are wild. So, you know, typically people hunt deer. Okay, so venison, I think venison can refer to other kinds of wild meat, like wild game, like uh, moose or, I don't know. It, but it's, it's typically, you know, when you hear the word venison, just think about deer meat. Okay, deer meat. Have you ever had venison? I've had venison. It's very good. It's really good. I mean, if I were, if I were a hunter, if I lived near the woods and I could go hunting for my own meat, if I could hunt wild game, I would, I would hunt for my meat and I would, uh, I would eat a lot of venison. But, um, you know, in the city, people, you know, they just go to the, they go to the store and they buy they buy their pork or they buy their uh, beef or their chicken. I don't think venison is sold in stores because it's wild game. I mean, usually wild game is not sold in normal stores here in Canada. I mean, maybe you can find it somewhere. Maybe you could find venison sausages or something like that. But uh, I don't know. I haven't looked for it. You know, people just eat the main meats, right? Beef pork chicken most people in canada don't even eat mutton or lamb in other cultures it's more you know more common uh, here people do eat fish and they eat chicken and they eat beef and pork those are the four kinds of meats they eat beef chicken pork fish okay now remember red meat is meat that is red Right? I mean, look at this, this meat, right? This meat, well, it's red. <laughs> it's, it's the color red. Whereas if you look at a piece of chicken, it's not really red. It's more like white. But even pork, pork isn't even that red. But it's called, but pork is called red meat as well. Okay, so there you have it. Um, let me know if you have any questions down in the comments about this stuff. Um, it's just interesting how we have different words for this in English, right? And like I said, a lot of languages in the world, when you when when they think of the word meat, it's it's equivalent to red meat in our culture. Okay, so don't use the word meat as a comparison to like chicken or fish, because those are meat as well in English, even though they're not meat in your language. Okay, so the word you're looking for is red meat. And according to Google, I'll just review what these red meats are. Beef, veal, lamb, mutton, pork, goat, and venison. What, on that list, what's your favorite? I would say on this list, my if I could choose <laughs> any one of these, guys, I love lamb. I love lamb and goat. Um, I love, you know, veal. I, I don't know if I've eaten a lot of veal in my life. Have you had veal? Because, like, if you go to the store and buy, like, some steaks, that's just going to be beef. I don't know what the age of the animal is. I I know they sell veal in the stores, but I, I think veal is more expensive than, than beef. I, you know, I don't know, guys. I'm not a, I'm not a meat expert. But uh, I would say lamb and goat and venison. I don't know. I don't know, guys. I like all of them. <laughs> I like all of them. So how about you? Do you love all of them? Let me know what your favorite kind of meat is, if you like red meat or if you prefer white meat or uh, chicken or fish or... Uh, let's see. So here on this, um, in this little explanation here, you can see right there, right? It says, uh, it does not include, so there's red meat, right? Red meat does not include uh, chicken, turkey, goose, duck, game, and rabbit. Okay, so remember, game means wild meat. 
because the word game has a different meaning, right? Game. I like playing a game like chess or other kinds of games, right? Uh, but game means can mean wild animals. And uh, so rabbits, I guess rabbits are not considered red meat. I don't know who makes up this stuff, but uh, that's what Google, the first first uh, search result on Google. <laughs> that's what it told, tells me. So um, anyway, guys, that's it for our meat discussion. So just remember when you're using the word meat, remember that it means all of the meats. And if you want to be specific, and talk about red meat, then you should use the word red meat. But you may as well just use the name of the meat itself, beef, or uh, if you're asking someone, you know, do you, do you like, do you prefer beef or chicken? Or do you prefer lamb or beef? Do you prefer pork or venison, right? You may as well just use the specific names of the meat because, you know, red meat includes a bunch of animals, right? Anyway, guys, if you want to join me for a steak, you are more than welcome. And uh, thank you guys for watching my videos. I really appreciate it. And um, as always, I love you so much. Hope you're having a great day. And I'll see you over in the next episode of Mad English TV. Take care.